height and age difference. He is holding her up. 26 and 16. I wonder what her family thinks about this. Like, oh yeah, I've been seeing this guy. He's a rapper. Uh, uh. Oh yeah. Yeah, he dropped out of high school for me. So like, or, oh, we have to get married during the summer because he's 16 and he'll be out of school then or something. Like, I, like what, bro? What? <laughs> bro, what? <laughs> I'm saying the same thing, gang. I ain't gonna lie. What? <laughs> 10 years is so crazy, bro. And nobody bats an eye at this, but I promise you, if she was 16 and he was 26, everybody would be like, what are you doing what it's still weird bro i'm not gonna lie this is insane yeah forget the height bro he's 16 gang he still got like another 10 years to grow she's fully finished and her family should be looking at her like ma'am what are you doing like there's plenty of 20 something year old people that you could talk to and instead you're talking to this little rapper kid because he's got money and i guess if that's all she's looking for i guess i don't know that's a robot chicken I'm telling you nobody's got what you got okay tentacles ready and action oh wait whoa oh ooh, oh yeah squidward I'm a big bright shining star. <laughs> oh nah. Oh nah. I knew he had a star drunk because ain't no way he lives like that. That's <laughs> Yo. I'm telling you, nobody's got what you got. Nobody's got what you got. Yeah, bro. Yeah. Anyone who even has this type of video pop up on their reels completely cursed bro completely cursed bro i'm not even gonna lie like this is bad looks gang this is really bad you can make it by himself yeah i was thinking about where that second tentacle was gonna go and i was like dang bro like this is actually like kind of you know what i'm saying there's a little too ao I know what to do when a stranger tries to talk to you walk away very good you why is he moving like that get one piece of candy doesn't that negate the idea of taking candy from strangers? Yeah, kick her off. So we're not strangers, we're your local neighborhood crime fighters. Clearly, you guys are just people with no jobs. Yeah, well, at least I'm not <laughs> dying. I'd rather die than grow up like you. You know what, everyone? This little boy can talk to as many strangers as he wants because, quite frankly, no rapist will want that in the back of their car. Oh my god! If you guys know. <laughs> Yo! Yo, hey, I bet that kid shut up after that, though. No. I bet that kid shut up after that. Did he say specifically? Sometimes you just gotta let him know. He said, "Sit down, nigga." Riley Freeman is a third grade student at J. Edgar Hoover Elementary School. He's a basketball player, an avid reader, and one day hopes to spread his philosophy through rap music. He was in class when he had a verbal exchange with his teacher, Joe Petto. But Mr. Petto said it was Riley who used the N-word first. So I told him to take his seat, and here comes this barrage of insults. I mean, some of the words I've never even heard before, and I was just stunned. And I said, well, sit down, nigga. <laughs> I just repeated the insult back to him because that's what I've been trained to do. That is not what he's been trained to do. Get away from the door, nigga. <laughs> and I was just, I repeated the same insult because that's sort of what I've been trained to do. The school district says that is not what they trained English teacher <laughs> Paul Dawson to do. He tried to say I said it and for some, and I didn't say it and no one else in the class knows that I said it because I didn't. And what did he... Jesus Christ, bro. The amount of stuff that Boondocks could have now, if they were to, like, make a new season now, just off of 2024 alone, bro, you could have, like, probably two seasons full of content, bro. I'm not even gonna lie. For myself, I would never eat but Yo, I be really digging my face in the whole booty, bro. On some talented <laughs> shit bro, type shit. when it come down to eating ass, bro, I'm a 99 overall. Oh, wow. Liquor. 
you got like a Yelp page reviews. You be getting reviews. No, I don't really get. I don't really get no bad reviews. Like this girl told me, like she really told me, like you ain't got the biggest meat, but you know how I work it. I take that. I love that compliment. Cause right. that mean I got up in a place where them other niggas don't be at. I be behind the cervix. Hey, yo. You feel what I'm saying? You know what the cervix is, right? What is it? You don't even know because you never been back there. You never been back there. I be all inside of the, I be somewhere. I be somewhere totally different. I be tickling a bitch uh, esophagus. I, I be by the clip. <laughs> Fuck are you talking about? It's fucking cervix. And you shit. you outside the club. That's me, outside the club. What are you talking okay, about? Okay, Chris Breezy. He, he talking about outside You outside the club The lower and narrow end of the uterus Womb that connects the uterus To the vagina The vagina <laughs> <laughs> You can't read And you can't get in shape You too many things boy <laughs> He said you too many things Oh my god I'm good at though Eating <laughs> At a professional level I'm a good podcaster Yeah no no You definitely All a good right, podcaster for sure yeah. I used to tell my Hey at least he ended off on a compliment Jesus Christ, I don't know where we, uh, wait, okay, we didn't see that yet, but we seen this, okay, we didn't see this either, okay, what the, alright, what, what, what is happening, okay, we seen this, alright, that's where we ended off at, okay, got you, alright, oh, I just clicked the same video twice, no, I didn't. Uh, yeah. Miss Shaw too. Okay. What I love most about my home is who I share it with. <laughs> Farmers market, fruits, vegetables, and baked goods. <laughs> What's home doing that little laugh? Mm, could just take a nap right now. <laughs> hey guys, just remember, be thankful. Go on cruises. Why? Because they already been pulled by that shit once. <laughs> That's racist, dude. <laughs> What's the difference between a hooker and a drug dealer? I don't know. A hooker can wash her crack and sell it again. <laughs> okay, okay, I like that one. How many cops bad. does it take to, to screw in a light bulb? How many? None. They just beat the shit out of the room for being black. <laughs> Yo! <Wow. Hey>. <laughs> <laughs> Oh! <laughs> Yo, oh. that's two, nigga! No, no, chat, I'm not, no! Why don't black people go on cruises? Oh, wait, why did he cook that ice on that pizza like that? Why? Because. Is, like, is that like a comp method for pizza making? Italians in the chat, is this like. Is this comp? Are you actually supposed to do that with pizza? I want to make my own pizza from scratch. Uh, I'll do a pizza making stream one of these days. I like black people. I just wish they would be more useful like they used to be. Huh? You what know, like. What you mean by that? What the during fuck the does that mean? <laughs> like during the times like when they used to, you know, we didn't have to pay them as much and they used to do things for us. Oh my god. What the <laughs> fuck is going on, bro? So she's saying that as if like. Black people aren't human. Holy shit, bro. Sophia, bro. Sophia, Fuck bro. You. Get off this app, bro. You need fucking help, bro, mentally. There's no way you just fucking said that, Sophia. Are you okay? I'm fine. Nigga, you just said you miss slaves. <laughs> <laughs> Is that an issue? Yes, bro. <laughs> Is that I'm an issue? It's so bro. crazy. Oh, no. You would have. You would love if I was home right now. Because I have a big KFC tapestry in my room. You just said. I <laughs> okay, there's no way this is real. Okay, all right. There, there's no way she, she I The fact that she had said the KFC part at the end, it makes me believe that this isn't, like, she's not, she doesn't actually believe that, bro. There's no way. Oh, we already see that. There's no way, bro. Like, genuinely, there's no way. Why do you feel like I'm a single mother? I mean, you pretty, but you fussed You've been prostituted. That's now not. I guess you gonna be a single mother too, then. I ain't gonna be no single mother like mama. What? 
Um, what's wrong with being a single mother? I ain't finna mess around with no three kids. Okay, why do you think I'm a single mom? Because you work for free. I work for free. <laughs> I work Monday through Friday. And how do you feel like I work for free? Because you broke. Alrighty. Now, let's not least now. Don't say nothing crazy. But why do you feel like I'm a single mom? Because you don't be yourself. How you feel like I don't, I don't be myself? That's not even, That's not even your real hair. <laughs> oh my God. I can wear a wig if I want to. Yeah, yeah. but without a wig, you look like a grown man. What? The Nala. Oh what? my God. Why would she ask them these questions, bro? She knows her kids are just unfiltered, bro. That's insane. Now, this video probably did amazing numbers on Facebook, though. Oh, my God, bro. This is the type of stuff that my aunt watches on Facebook. Oh, my God, bro. Wait, I might actually have to save this video, though. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I might have to save this, bro. Where the save button at? Oh, yeah. I'm going to save this. I'm going to send this to my aunt. This is 100% the type of video she would watch on Facebook. All right. This is before that. When did you stop becoming racist, when if you don't I mind me asking? That, when I seen that white man fucking that black girl, dude. When was this? Like, how this recently was, was it? Two days ago in the alley behind the Bellagio. <laughs> I was so upset because why wasn't that me? Those big lips. What? How they just wrapped around that dick when I see... Oh, my God. Lord. Have mercy. Are those her lips or are those her pussies? Damn. I think those are her pussy lips. We got to find this chick, bro. I was bro. trying to understand it because I wonder if she was doing it for the money. I don't care, but she was beautiful though. He finished her off and she squirted. Oh my God. Right. That's what made me unracist. I was racist. How long was he watching for? It's a very interesting interaction there. Look, your moves ain't working, dude. Oh yeah, it's a good shot, little bro. That's all right. But you doing all that moves? You ain't at work and stuff. Stuff. I want to see something else. Yeah, let's go. I want to see something. You know what to do? Oh, he giving it to you. He oh, said you like Ben Simmons. You can't shoot. Can you? Damn. Oh, hey yo, I think he can shoot. Yeah, you might he have to go up. You too Hell tall to not be guarding that. That's an easy block. Hell believe you, what? Stop. He'll believe you, stop. He'll believe you. Hey, look. Child, I'm doing y'all the same way, bro. Y'all leave me open like this, it's over. He believe you. Oh, yeah. Between his. No, he did. No. All right, Zay. You know what? Hey, Zay. Hey, Zay. You know I got you, right? Hey, Zay, you know I got you. Bro, if you don't want this little jitter. You, right, Zay. Hey, if you hit this, you done, Zay. Hey, you done, Zay. <laughs> hey, you done. Oh! Hey, little bro, go on places, bruh. Hopefully, you know, gets a little bit of hype. I don't want him to end up like Julian Newman. I need this next. Wait, what is this? Oh, call yeah, 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 yeah. We need this. We need this. We need this. The not 2K will be studied in universities. If there is a college game with 100% and never playing 2K again, that is not true. But college basketball 25 will be tough. The only problem is, the only problem is they're only going to be like a play now ultimate team kind of thing. Or are they going to add like some type of park rec, like something where you can create a character. Because if not... That's the only thing that's going to make it kind of weird. If it's only play now, people are obviously still going to play 2K because 2K's biggest game mode is my player or my career. You know what I'm saying? Speaking of my career, we still haven't watched the my career uh, gameplay trailer yet. Uh, remind me after we get done with these Instagram videos. But NCAA basketball will be tough. Bro, these Ugandans be going crazy on the, uh, on the ground, on this little soft ground wrestling, bro. Wait, is this in Uganda? I just assumed that. I'm 
I'm not getting 21 0 by a G. I'll give him a couple shots. But when I get the ball, he's not getting it back. I'm kind of surprised that like a real wrestler doesn't have to be a WWE wrestler. It could be like somebody like on the indies or something. Just like a real wrestler like hasn't came to one of these. You know what I'm saying? And like gave them, you know what I'm saying? Pointers and stuff like that. Maybe they have like DM'd them or something, but that's that's the part that kind of interests me about this whole thing. Like they're obviously like really talented. Yo! Okay, everything just like kind of froze. Are we good? So, okay, I think, alright, I think we're still alive and stuff. Okay. That was weird. Oh, King Sip gonna pull up. They love the spear, bro. They were doing it for that. Oh, it's a white guy. <laughs> the raw underground wishes it was. Facts. Ain't gonna lie, that little Ohio crowd was low key going kind of crazy though. For SummerSlam. Low key. They have an actual bell, or was that just a sound effect? 
Noise, noise, noise. They got their own bell and everything. Now that's tough though. I ain't gonna lie. I feel like this. I feel like you do this right here. Like your body is conditioned to smack against anything, bro. I ain't gonna lie. You going? You taking these like hits on the ground on that dirt like that? Oh my gosh, bro! Your knees, your back, your stuff. Oh my! God. I can't even imagine. I know that it hurt. I know it probably hurts at first, but then after a while, I get used to it. Cause this ain't even like the regular like plywood that most rings are made of. That's tough. You try. Chris and Meg versus the lunchroom. I feel like I might have seen this. See, why didn't you just stop time like that? Like to see you try. I like to see you try and then proceeds to just murder everyone in the cafeteria. Nice. Real nice. Real nice. Oh, Jesus. I don't know where we stopped at. All right, let's see. Okay. Yep. Definitely way after that. Okay. Let's, uh, here? Nope. Okay. Um, gotta be here. Nope. Okay. It's this one for sure. Like, I don't even have access to this account no more. That's the crazy part. Uh, to another episode of Busy Do Things With Me? Um,. Oh my gosh, I remember this video. Oh my god. Oh my god. Uh, uh, uh. Yo. Hey, yo. My boy. Nice hands you got there, my boy. Yo. Nice, nice hands you got there. What, what, why'd you. Why'd you turn this out, though? Wait, what's, what's the plan? What's the, what's the master plan? You know what I'm saying? Oh, oh my god. Yo, hey, yo, hey, yo. yo. Bro, what? Hey, that be a little fire, though. I ain't gonna lie. Hold up, bro. That, hold up. What? I'm gonna need you to make me one of those. I'm gonna give you the meat, though. I'm, pause, pause, pause. My digital footprint might be cooked. I'm not gonna lie, my digital footprint might be cooked. I completely forgot about this video, by the way. I used to do this all the time on TikTok, though. I'm not gonna lie. I used to have a whole bunch of duets, but that TikTok is deleted. I mean, it got banned. But that's crazy. That's like genuinely insane. I completely forgot about that. I'm not even gonna lie to you. Like, completely forgot that that even existed. Wow. That's like. That's that's bad looks. Bad PR. Mm -hmm. I think it had good things. I thought it was just Franz and Dennis Schroeder. Don't add me. German sweets are way better than American sweets. These are fire. Where did you get these? What is this? Like you a, gotta enjoy it. Like a deviled enjoy egg? It. No, it's chocolate. Is this caramel? caramel? Ooh. Bala sticks, yeah. We always had these in school. Bala sticks. Oh. Dude, I miss these. If these had a sour kick on them, these would be elite. This is chocolate bread. Oh, I love chocolate bread. Hold on. Tomatoes. I had, I had two. These are tomatoes. What, that's the comparison you get? Dude, they have like a Christmas uh, flavor to them. Oh, I love <laughs> Oh, I'm gonna break this one down. Gosh, gosh. It's like the gingerbread, it's like, it's got like a pumpkin. Camera too. Let's go. Breathe. I don't know what you're talking about. I see they know what they're doing with the chocolate. That's German? Mm -hmm. German snacks are fire and the jerseys is cold. The rumors are true. German candy is top tier. I'm not even really a huge candy person like that. I I, I mean, I'd be down to try yeah, it. No my grandmother died? Yeah. Right. On the real, um, see, a lot of people don't understand. Like, when I start saying long live granny, that's because I wanted my grandmother to live. Long. Like, my grandmother, she was. Damn. Why you laughing, bro? What's funny, yeah. my nigga? <laughs> he hey, bro, what's all that laughing, bro? <laughs> so it's Why all you that laughing, laughing bro? bro? Lock in, bro. Stop laughing, bro. <laughs> Can you, can bro, can you stop laughing, bro? Long live me, she gone, cuz. Listen, bro, listen. Can you hear me? Can I tell my story, bro? <laughs> can I tell my story, bro? Before she died. Bro, listen, can I tell my story? Yeah, go ahead. Like I said, when I originally started, and I started saying long live granny, it's because I wanted my grandmother to live long. But why you still... You jinxed her. You jinxed her. <laughs> no, I did not. Listen, my grandmother, my grandmother was older, so she already... Listen, listen, my grandmother was older, so she already was going to pass away. You hurry up. No, listen, 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 listen. So... 
boom. Hurry up is my so crazy. My grandmother was already, like, my grandmother been old most of my life for real. Like, I was born, she already was 89. Don't laugh, my nigga. Do not laugh. Talk, bro. I'm good. <laughs> 89 being born is I'm insane good. Same work, bro. I ain't gonna lie. He's saying long live because I want her to live long. <laughs> you jinxed it. You know my That's so insane, bro. I'm not even gonna lie. It's so crazy. My uncle, you know my other uncle, he died. He used to drink a lot for real. That was a younger son. Normal experience. Yeah, basically. So when he died, we didn't really give a fuck about him. We mm -hmm. cremated him. But grandma, grandma kid. Yeah, grandma gave a fuck. So when he died, she used to see him all the time, walking around the house and shit. So, mind you, the nigga a ghost. And this is how I knew ghost really was real. Niggas probably ain't going to believe me, but I'm in the bathroom beating my meat. I hear somebody whisper past my ear, stop getting that nut out you. <laughs> what? <laughs> Who the, what? Who the fuck is this? You feel me? I'm on some, I'm on some, I'm on some poltergeist ghostbuster shit now. What? So now bro. I just start spinning around this while I'm beating my meat. I'm words. trying nut on the ghost. You feel what I'm saying? Try to find him. <laughs> you feel me? <laughs> like, shit, yo, shit be crazy, yo. Like I said, my grandmother fell on the steps We're before she passed away. How you trying nut on the ghost, though, yo? That's great, bro. Change the subject. What are we even, what are we, what are we even really talking about here? What is this? You see, you seen Dr. Doolittle? I, bro, I actually wanted to be a veterinarian when I was young. I swear to God, I never want to be a comedian. It. I seen it. You you can I see it. It's the way your head. Go. No, it's the way that you're eating so much food. Big back, <laughs> Biggie back. Hate, yo, I hate the big back turn. Like, where the fuck that come from, yo? You you created. We it. Were, nah, yo, I wouldn't have got this. I know color. Was gonna come up with that shit. No, nah, that's that was natural. I told you, yo, call me at six thirty. You call me at six or seven. Don't too much. It ain't your time, boy. Twenty three minutes, heavy. Tight. Hey, shout out the floaters real quick. Y'all already know what's going on. Shout out to Florida. This is a girl. He's funny one. We tapping now. Tapping now. Oh, shit. What the wrong thing? bro. Yeah, you is. Take me. If you don't know this. Oh, yeah. This lady right here, Pauline Brown, I'm sure you will soon. She is a force Pauline to be reckoned with. Pauline Target Brown. No cap. I'm thinking about putting some money on her books, because. Yeah. So anyway, it was a fine Tuesday morning. Probably a great day too. This look like an AI image, bro. Why she look like that? Oh, she look like she look like Scooby Doo. No, 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 no. Walk with me here. She looks like Scooby Doo, bro. Pauline got. Just her. look at her she face while, like, while the video going on. I think on, I want to go. Y'all gonna see it, bro. Some some chitlins, some beans, you know, some rice gravy, all, all, all that good should be. So boom, you know, she elderly. Look at her. She like seventy years old. Anybody over the age of sixty. They they all handicapped, you feel me? So so she was going on about her normal kind of day. True. She finna whip into the handicapped parking lot, you know? <laughs> and mind you, she driving a minivan like what's on the cover of uh, Kendrick Lamar album. What was that? Good good kid? Good kid yeah, good. Yeah, what he said. Now, boom. As Granny goes to pull into her handicapped spot, because she is handicapped, this little, this little pale-skinned brother and his little brother decides to cut Granny off. Get into the parking spot that they don't even belong in. Now That's you messed me, up. You, you see where they're going. Granny like, what? I'm handicapped for real. I know these little two white boys ain't even, they ain't even got no health problems. You feel me? I'm a 70-year-old woman. Like, you're supposed to leave that for me. You feel me? Now, not only did they cut this lady off in her good old little handicapped parking spot, they took two hours in the grocery store. What were you getting in Target? For two whole hours, you a nineteen year old. They probably just vibing. What the, what they probably just vibing. I ain't gonna lie. How do you? How were you doing two hours worth of shopping? But anyway, besides the point. Now during that that two hours, Granny waiting on them. Yeah, yeah. Granny. Oh. Uh, stalking her position. Uh. Post it up. What are you talking at? Old now people got all the time in the world. Granny has one simple question: Are you handicapped? Now this one simple question got one right answer. He didn't get the right answer. He said, nah, nah, yo, black lady, I ain't handicapped. I just needed to park closer to the door. She said, bet, well, you finna be closer to the floor. She pulled out a 22, mm, cap, cap. She put two 22s in two of this man's knees. Both of them. She kneecapped this boy. Now, as he's screaming, trying to got things scramble, get back in the store, like somebody call 911. 911 done pulled up. They in the parking lot. Is Granny pulling out of the parking lot? But Granny like, nah, mm-mm. I ain't even done here. Y'all done called the cops on me after you was in the wrong. So what Granny do? I'll give you some I'll give you some time to, to guess what Granny did. Ran him over. She went to her back seat and pulled out an AR and a bulletproof vest. What are you talking about? That low-key made me feel like she was prepared for this. Like she low-key came to Target to put some shit down, but 
I'm gonna tell you more why I feel like that a little later. But boom, like I said, cops is pulling in, she pulling out, she like, nah, slam on brakes, hop out, pull an AR out the back seat, bulletproof vest. She's shabigging with the police. And not only is she shabigging with the police, she put one down. She mm, and hit one in the shoulder game. Like she came on some real, some, some real Call of Duty esque, like Shorty came with a mission. And she completed that drone. And look, it beats me how she made it back to the police station, but they got her in the car, you feel me? Not harmed, back to the police station, you know? And as they interviewing her, investigating her, he said, me, I'm just a little old lady, but I did this because I'm tired of all you cauliflower crusaders. She turned into a black activist right there. She was like, I turned on the news and I saw Sonya Massey. So obviously I had to get my get back for Sonya. And so that's how you have Pauline Brown, you know? Shabig and three white men in the target and downing one. Living to tell the story, I guess. Well, shit, I'm telling the story, but hey, free Sonya. She innocent. She ain't do nothing wrong. That white boy. I mean, oh, fuck. <laughs> I meant free Pauline. I'm so sorry. Long live Sonya, bro. That was some fucked up shit. <laughs> um, I'm going to just end it right here. I... <laughs> That's uh. That's something I ain't gonna lie. Like that's kind of crazy, gang. Um, I'm getting a T-shirt with our name on it. Grammy one. <laughs> Thought she a retired marine. She was a retired marine, and she had a bulletproof vest. She was ready. There's no way this was real, though. It's, yeah, I don't know why they do this. I swear, I was thinking this. They got me the first time. That guy shooting that cop daughter. This isn't the first time. As soon as he said, like, she shot them, and then, like, no, I was like, oh, okay. Like, I seen that part coming, but then, like, it just kept getting crazier. So I'm just like, dude, there's no way this is real, bro. There's just no way. But if anybody asks me, yeah, 100%, I believe this is real, though. Dang, I have no idea where we left off at. We watched, uh, I think it's this one. Okay, back. Question, cause somebody bought him. <laughs> See, you get this cause this? I'd believe it. 100%. My grandma, like, she'd do that. Sales out of a hit. That had been tried on us before. Well, anyway, one guy, W little guy. He knew we was coming. The party was all over the street. We snatched him up, put him in a van. And, uh, of course, I started talking to him. So, how do you want it? Bullet in the head, or you want me to chop your head off with my axe? Oh. Man, come on, man, don't do this to me. Man, I'll pay you not to do it. I said... And then he seen the way I was looking, thinking about him. Man, I'll give you double. Double? <laughs> my boy looked at me, too. He said, man, it's on you. I said, then check this out. Can you get us the money? Because we ain't gonna let you go to, to, to go get it. I'm gonna just do you and take the money that I'm gonna be paying for. But if you can get that money to us without no motherfucking backlash, I won't. He said, I'm calling my sister. He did, he called his sister. Told his sister where to take it to where we told him to have a date. And we sat back and we watched her bring the bag, sitting there, and then she left. Two seconds later, his phone rang. Yeah, okay. Hold on. I gave it to him, man. He said, Thanks, sis. I love you. I love you. You saved my life. And he really did save your life because I promise you that I won't kill you. And that's my word. Now, okay, so I go get the uh -huh. bag. I get the bag, I come back. He said, see, there's all that. Said, Man, really is? Okay, I'm gonna kill you. My boy said, but I didn't say I wasn't gonna kill you. Boom! <laughs> I'm like, okay. <laughs> I kept my word, though. I didn't do you. He did you. I ain't gonna lie. Hey, that's really the way to do it, though. No cap. You can't even, you know what I'm saying? He said he wasn't gonna do it. He ain't do it. I mean, like, it's all right. I would have did the same thing. I loaded it. I tried on fry by the way he had to go. Flavor with me. You get lemon garlic shrimp, lemon garlic steak and shrimp, barbecue bacon ranch, and buffalo chicken. So make sure you stop by your local Mr. Fry's man to get you one. Yeah. Feed about four to five people, but it all depends. I hope you are. Hello. Bro, that shrimp look good on there, bro. I ain't even really no big shrimp person for real, bro. Because I'm telling you, every time I eat shrimp, I get more hungry, bro. It's something about shrimp. Oh no, I'd probably have to eat a whole bucket of shrimp like it's popcorn or something in order for me to feel something, bro. Well, I ain't gonna lie, bro. Pop like, shrimp just don't do nothing to me no more. I don't know.
Like, it's really seafood in general, except for, like, fish. Like, if we're talking, like, salmon, tilapia, stuff like that, like, I can eat that, and I'd be cool. But, like, we're talking, like, crab legs or shrimp. Eh, I can eat that all day. It's really the sauce that, like, fulfills me, you know what I'm saying? It's not the actual, like, meat itself. 30 days of 30-minute dinners, day 19, oh and I want to share with you one of the most delicious ways to serve chicken thighs for dinner. We're just going to oh. season our boneless, skinless chicken thighs and fry them in a little bit of oil oh. until they're lightly charred on the outside and cooked through the center. Then we're yeah. going to fry some onion, chorizo, and garlic and reduce down some white wine and then create a sauce for some stock, cream, and parmesan. Once that thickens up, you can go in with your baby plum tomatoes and fresh basil along with the resting juices from the chicken, then nestle the thighs back in and you're oh. left with this absolutely delicious one pan and creamy chicken and chorizo. It's so full of flavor, so definitely give it a go. And the full recipe is just below. Cheers. Oh, yeah, that look good. <clears throat> stop you now, Key. Ain't nothing you getting your way now, Key. Nothing's gonna stop you, Key. You're on your way to success. This is what success looks like, Key. This is what success looks like, Key. You're on your way to success. Don't give up, Key. If I'm in the gym, Mind you, I have on my Beats in the gym. Noise canceling. Beat Studios. I don't hear anything. So if something is loud enough for me to hear it with my music, like, blaring, and I look over and I see this dude talking in the mirror with the cargo shorts on, bald head, hey, you got it, gang. You got it. I'm. This is my last workout. I don't care if I just walked in there. You got it. Hey, you... You go do what you got to do. I don't even want to be in your way. You know what I'm saying? Cause th don't give up. This is the type Let's of person go. that you can't you can't mess around with unk like that. Ten sets of motivation. Everybody plug a little motivational, but he chill. <laughs> no ash eyes or nothing. I was meant to see this. All right, uh, what's the motivation behind this? And it's viral. No facts. I ain't gonna lie. You put some motivational music in the back of this. Oh, Unk posting, posting too. Oh yeah, Unk. I like that out of you, gang. I like that. I just love my dog. Think of my brother told me how to date. <laughs> Why she look back at her hand like? Why is it not coming off? What's wrong with you? She trying to save, bro. <laughs> bro, it's the like, bro, it's the fact that she like looking back up at him, and then she look at her hand like, yo, what, like, why is it still there? I'm trying to get it off of you. I'm trying to save you. Yo. That's a real one, bro. This is the type of friend you need in your life, bro. I'm not gonna lie. Hopefully, they became lifelong friends after that. I doubt it, though. But, you know. Look at the comments. Wait, comments what video? No, I'm not gonna have a... I'm looking at food. That's not true. You keep going hard. You like, ever get caught in a girl's room like that? I Where did, like three, four times. Damn. Oh, this video? <laughs> what if daddy walk in there and say I'm next? One time I went what? Bed. what? What are you talking mm -hmm. about? What happened? What? <laughs> I'm gonna be, if I was to ever, you know, be getting raped by another man. Yeah. What? Yikes. I would all from head. Yeah, I talk about it on the album. Who the hell raped your sister? Yo. Every time people talk about, like, I see, like, one of these Charlemagne compilations, I always think about this video right here, bro. I've seen this video so many times, and it still, like, baffles me. Because I saw the whole interview to see, like, if there was any context on, like, where that question would have came from. There is none. He, bro, Charlemagne's brain is so interesting to me, bro. I, I, I want to have a conversation with him, bro. I really like his brain. Yeah, I talk about it on the album. Who the hell raped your sisters? Oh, man, I don't want to get into that. Yeah, it's a little yeah, too personal. Right? Okay. Not worth it. If Takashi Six Nine, <laughs> if Takashi Six Nine beats this case, I'll suck his dick. <laughs> <laughs> like, bro, what? Are you are you a registered sex offender? Nah, I'm not. Um, but you convicted of sex I knew offender? That, nah, I'm not. You could actually look it up. You got a computer right there. Yeah, I did. I, 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 that's why. That's why I asked. Because I mean, you, can't you, know? you can't believe nothing you see on the internet. That's wait, why I'm wait, asking. Wait. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's facts though. That's facts though. Power, but it wasn't that's facts. as well. Oh, you oh, got right. recent nudes. Um, no. <laughs> <laughs> as he 
has the computer phone up. No, bro, Charlamagne's not, not real. He's not real. He's not real. College, you can't you talk about to... hamsters after just talking about your butt. Like, that's six dollars. Can we? Can I see what that mouth do though for six dollars? How much you got in me? Twenty six dollars. No. You let me and him run a train on you right now. What can you get for twenty six? Oh my god. You can buy me a drink for twenty six dollars. Whoa. Can we slip something in your drink? Then take advantage of you. <laughs> <laughs> yo, yo, no, 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 there's no way. There's actually no way. There's no way he's real, bro. Hey, Dad, stay humble. Right. At the end of the tour. What is that? What am I looking at? Is this a kid? Bro, it looks like Tyler the Creator mixed with like something from Ratchet and Clank. She got us all iPods. And she's beautiful. Oh, See, and y'all at y'all the age where y'all can sneak in her dress room when she's getting so dressed I'm, and she I'm wouldn't not, trip. Not, not, not. You know what I'm saying? They can see her naked though. and they wouldn't that's, trip. That's it's like, Janet. oh, it's just them. She get dressed in front of y'all. <laughs> Do what with the drink? <laughs> A train for twenty six dollars. <laughs> they take advantage of you. Oh my god, bro. Oh my god. Nah, bro. Nah, Charlamagne is. Bro. <laughs> He's not a real person, bro. He can't be, bro. He can't be. This is the nicest form of racism. Why is she kinda. What? You're different from us. <laughs> As that she couldn't go back. She was testing the product before she buys it. She now has a new crush. No, she's probably like her default like emote is smiling. But she was looking at it like why is it not coming off? Who's gonna tell her that there are colored humans? Well she just found out today. Try to skin his skin too, she ain't alone. They're so innocent. Ah, uh, gang, use the wrong there in the Instagram comment section, bro. You might as well just go ahead and delete this, bro. Not gonna lie, first comment about to be, yep, I knew it. I already knew it, bro. That, why did you try to correct? Are you? No, that's this is rage bait right here. This is rage bait, hundred percent rage bait. It is there, like they are. It's a, it, it's, it's a English thing. Yeah. Oh my god, my cheekbones hurt, bro. Oh my god, that was hilarious, bro. That Charlamagne is not real, bro. <laughs> it's my spirit animal. Like five years, IG comment is gonna be the worst app ever. It's already worse. Like I think IG, I think IG might be the worst uh, app comment wise. Yeah, I was thinking about there's some sides of TikTok that are really bad, but like it's not as bad as Instagram. Especially now that Instagram has like you can reply with like the gifts and stuff. Like, it's bad. Nah, Reddit, it's like, you kind of have to go find the bad parts on Reddit. Reddit's low-key been getting a lot better. I'm not gonna lie. Because people are, like, fact-checking stuff on Reddit lately. So it's like, Reddit's become more of a, like, searching type thing than it is just, like, a place that just spews negativity. Everybody goes on Twitter if they want to be negative now, though. It used to be Reddit, but now it's just Twitter. Get on your knees. What was he talking about? I said, if you get on your knees, you're supposed to cry. Oh. If, you're singing, if you're singing a song. Oh, okay. We segwaying into the Drink Champs interview. <laughs> when you was with Nori and Fab and Jada and mm -hmm. everybody, they made a compilation video of you because they said you were sounding real suspect mm. on, the, on the interview. Yeah. Did you see that? Of course nah. I didn't see it. No, nah, I didn't see it. You didn't see it? I saw the guy. Oh, Come yeah. on, man. You saw hey, that on World hey, Star hey, and hey, on yo, the Gram. Check, check this out. When they started playing the game, the pause game, I would definitely. That came from Harlem, too, by Yeah, it came from Harlem. I definitely. Yeah, yeah. yeah I mean. What kind of plug is this? So don't do it because I, I know I'm bad at the game. Like, <laughs> what? <laughs> I know I say like reckless stuff out my mouth that's just not maybe, you know, adding up to with somebody who maybe somebody who's homophobic, but I'm not homophobic and I really don't, you know, care. You know what I'm saying? I just, 
But um, I'm bad at the game, and it's probably hilarious. I would love to see it. I would love to see the video compilation. It's hilarious. 50, yeah. 50 came up here, and he was giving you flack for the asking Fab the party. So you, he'll ask you, oh, he'll ask you to play it, play it, play the clip, man. Yeah, play the clip. Go ahead. Why won't you party with me for your birthday, man? I'm, I, yeah, we we party for my birthday before. You came to my party. And, and... No, but me and you ain't never really party, you know what I'm saying? I look at Diddy face. I asked 50 about that. And he said you did the same thing to him. You asked him to take him shopping. Yeah, I thought he needed some clothes. <laughs> 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 what? I'm a nice guy. What the fuck? Yo, what? I mean, why are you with Fifty? Hey yo, why y'all got? Hey yo, I don't have no beef with with with. with I don't know why. With, with Fifth, he loves me. Hmm. He loves me. Do y'all really can't have see a beef? It? I mean, y'all can't see. No, it. we can't. Y'all can't it, see man. that he loves me. But see, you really hold on. Oh. You really think that's hate? You really, when you Whoa. really break it down, you've been out here a long bro, time. Bro, look at his face, bro. Look at his you face. Know he loves look at what he's me. looking at him. Like it. You know he loves me. I don't think he likes Okay. But why, but why not? Y'all just, y'all both passionate. Y'all both. I don't know. I, I, yo, check this out. I don't, I don't know. Like I don't. the same. No, we are not. Okay. We, we are not, not the same. <laughs> but, I mean, we are not cut the from the same cloth. Definitely not the same. Yeah. And, 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 um, you know, I mean, I respect that. I don't, I don't never hit him with no, you know, nothing. I don't even think of no other man, man. Besides, if I'm thinking about another man, I'm thinking about uplifting. I'm not thinking about all that. All them gnats, you know, they, they can't really touch me. Y'all, at the end of the day, y'all see and y'all know what it is. Mm -hmm. You know, the, the track record. Y'all know, know the business acumen. Y'all know the community service. Y'all know what I'm about. Uh, all right, Diddy. <laughs> what you telling the eyes asking them questions? Did he see nothing sus about this? When he's staring at him, hard to read his body language to get real answers because we all know Diddy gonna lie. It's crazy because like he look, he be like, what? Like, I'm I'm just a good guy, <laughs> bro. That's that's too. Reddit is my <laughs> yo. What <no. laughs> It's stupid stuff too like that like yeah. i was i was big on the stupid stuff like putting um i put a paper clip in a uh outlet and it and it like blew up on me and in, in my face for real for real and yeah i, I did a little stupid so stuff how long like you that. been suicidal no i was not <laughs> what? <laughs> what kind of question is that therapy so Unless it is your story bro, i'm not gonna lie there's no way this sister moment is number four bro this has to be either two or one this is so crazy. Like he just got done talking about his sister, and like, yeah, we talked about it on the album, and then he just goes. And it's my this. story, you know what I'm saying? But he get, he got over. It. He's like, whatever. Yeah, I talk about it on the album. Who the hell raped your sisters? Oh man, I don't want to get into that. Yeah, it's a little yeah, too personal. Yeah. But, but, you ever get caught that, in a girl's room like that? I when did. Her dad came home like three, four times. Damn. Yeah. What happened? <laughs> what if daddy walked just, in there and say I'm next? One a, time I went in the bed. What, what are you talking <laughs> about? What happened? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Four, four, both. Why do you say that? I mean, because you're an athlete, so that's what you've basically been trained to do. So no matter what it is with your man, you got to be better. I'm going to make you come first. <laughs> On any beat, that's an adaption. I'm running out of breath. I'm bringing it back in. Need my money up front. Don't deal with a back end. Your pockets on a diet, nigga. I'm calling you Atkins. Nah, that ain't it, y'all. <laughs> Listen, man. Uh, <laughs> you are <laughs> no, Volume <laughs> 1, Fur Coat, Volume no, 1, November 20th. Charlemagne. You was he too aggressive, said, man. You too hyper. No, because nah, man, that, ain't I, I, that was a diss track to you. That's why. He said, mm, "Nah, that ain't it." <laughs> nah, that ain't it. Oh, bro, you bro, that logic one is so crazy, bro. I'm not gonna lie, bro. Oh my gosh. Yeah, I never heard that Drewski one. I ain't heard that Drewski one before. He said, I'm not gonna be suicidal. <laughs> like, what? <laughs> Just a kid doing dumb stuff. Like, was clutched up on July. Okay, it was July 31st? Oh, we're good then. We're good. Oh! Bro, I'm trying to not to laugh. Help me. Oh, Bro, I'm not gonna lie. What was it? Oh my gosh! I think my cousin. Uh, I think it was Black Ops Two. My my little cousin. Uh, we used to live in the same room together, right? And we have one TV where we play Black Ops Two. 
So I'm watching him play Black Ops 2 because I'm like, all right, I'm going to just play after he gets done. You know, I'm going to get my hour on the game next, right? And I'm watching him try to get his sniper's diamond. I think he was on, like, the challenge where you have to get five kills in a row and then, uh, you know, you have to do it, like, 20 times or something like that. So he's trying to, he's on, like, kill number four. And I'm just praying on his downfall because he was a rager. And he would, like, rage and throw stuff and everything. So I'm like... I'm watching him. I'm like, bro, oh, my God. I'm like, this is about to be so funny if he dies here, bro. He would die, throw the controller on the ground, throw his head into something, like, just start crying. And I'm just like, yo, what is going on, bro? Like, it was it was bad, bro. It was bad. Bad looks. <laughs> bro, where did Freddy come from? I didn't even realize what the game was at first. I see now. I see now. I see now. <sighs> Crying at Roblox is kind of crazy, though. But at least he's not playing anything else, though. Oh, yeah, if I lose last minute to FIFA, try the death penalty. I'm not even a rager, though. I don't rage when I play games, for real, for real. I don't rage when I play games. I play, um... I do play rage-inducing games, but I just... I, I just don't rage. Like, I... I'm I, I'm pretty uh pretty chill as far as that goes. Now I do like dibble dabble in the you know occasional swearing, but that's about it. That's about it. I don't I don't rage though. I don't rage. Like even if I die, like oh, it wasn't even in the video. One of the Elden Ring videos, I died with 900k runes because I was farming, and then I randomly came across a boss. And I died, couldn't get the runes back, and then I died again. And oh my gosh, like I was all, like I almost broke down in tears. I was like, bro, I almost lost a million runes for no reason. Like I could have just used them. I just wanted to wait until I had a million, and then I was gonna use them all at once. Oh my, God, I was so sad, bro. I was like, dang, like I just threw on some sad music and just grinded out a million more runes. Like it was so sad. It took me like 20 minutes to get it, but still, like that was like, bro. I was so sad. And then I get to the DLC and I can die with 800k and I wouldn't even care. Like, but that was so sad though. But never do I think about like, just like, boom, like punching my desk or something like that. Because I don't, it doesn't help. At least me, it doesn't help. Maybe it helps some people beating their controller against a wall or something just helps get that anger out. But like, I, that doesn't help me. Like, literally, I'll still be mad. Playing with makes you rage. Your favorite game ever? Uh, uh, I I guess I guess yeah, I mean technically because that just means that you care about it. But I don't know. I rage playing Rocket League and I and that is not my favorite game ever. So I guess it really depends. Like I just don't like losing. So it's like that's that's why that's part of the reason why I play so many games just so I can be like good at anything. Just in case, you know, just in case that opportunity presents itself. Somebody's like, yo, I play this game. I'm like, I'm better than you. And then we play and then I'm better than you. Like, that's real. That's part of the reason why I play so many different games. Because I definitely could just lock in on one game and then just be really, 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 really good at that game. But it's the fun in that. That means I'm going to be spending the rest of my days playing nothing but Apex Legends for 13 hours a day? Nah. I'd rather play Multiverses for 8 and... Literally makes zero rank progress because, you know, good old Samurai Jack. I'm not, I'm not sad about it at all. I'm just, you know. I definitely didn't waste the whole night one night playing multiverses for no reason. Didn't happen to me.